Welcome back, everyone, to the next installment of Doki Doki Literature Club. It's day two? Again? And it's... we're in fucked up time. <laughs> yeah, something went down between Yuri and Natsuki, and it's... And bigger, Monica, it's, really. It's bigger than what we actually saw, and we saw it get pretty uncomfortable. And then Natsuki runs out crying, and Yuri's like, please forgive me, like, what happened? Another day passes, and it's time for the club meeting already. I can't wait. And there was nothing in between. I've gotten a little bit more comfortable here over the past couple yeah, of days. This is the same, I think. The usual scene. But, well, the usual scene. Uh -uh. No sorry, right? Welcome back, Lotus. Uh, hi, Yuri. Yeah, this will be different. <laughs> I'm not sure if it's me or if it's Yuri's expression. I don't know, like... This is actually going to bother me, because this really might be me doing nothing. But did her neutral expression always look like this in the first playthrough? This is her, like, in her normal shy face. It is? Yeah. Okay. But the weight of yesterday's quarrel still hangs in the air a little. Uh, um... Yuri glances over her shoulder, looking around the room. Natsuki is reading manga at a desk. And surprisingly, Monica isn't here yet. She's the prince. She's the president. Maybe she killed her. Suddenly, <laughs> probably Yuri takes my arm and pulls me to the corner of the room. Yeah, this, this is wholesale. Yeah. Okay. Okay. We're we're in it to win it. I, I like that the background changed, but she didn't, so it looked really weird. Yeah, I've never I've never seen this before. About yesterday, I I really need to apologize. Nothing like that has ever happened before, and something just came over me. I guess I wasn't acting mentally sound. Please don't think we're usually like this. Not just me, but Natsuki as well. Yuri, I'm happy that you were considerate and apologized. You don't have to worry about too much. Uh, worry too much. We'll, 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 we'll see about that. Yeah, yeah, seriously. Even though I've only been here a couple days, I could tell something was off yesterday. Uh, yeah, I guess this is day three then. Maybe I introduced this wrong, whatever. Maybe we were just a little extra sensitive because it was our first time sharing poems. Oh, that's right. This is day three. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because uh, we, yeah, we, we came in, did our homework, did and day game. two was the poems. Yeah, yeah. we did the minigame. Yeah. Twice. Uh, yep. But whatever it was, it didn't make me think any less of you. I had already decided that there was no way you could be a bad person. Ugh, calm down. Calm yeah, down. No, she'll reveal it. <laughs> <laughs> and now you're apologizing. I know you really didn't mean it. Uh, Lotus, don't say those kinds of things so frankly. They make me a little too happy. I'm really glad that you're such an understanding person. And I'm really glad that you joined this club. Everything is a little bit brighter with you around, and... Uh, sorry, what am I saying right now? Yeah, this is a lot more sudden brand than brand. usual. This is all brand new. I just... She was a lot shyer before. Way shyer. Yeah. Hey, have you guys seen Monica? Yeah, that... Okay. <laughs> that was a little weird. Did you stuff her in a trash can or something? And wait a minute. Did Natsuki forget? Yeah. Like... She doesn't know what... She doesn't seem to be rea reacting completely. poorly to Yuri. Yeah. Uh, no, I haven't... Oh, I was, this is me. This is me. Not you. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm oh, I, I just did the ah. Uh. Not you. Yeah, sorry. I forgot. I'm, You're not Lotus. I'm Lotus. It was really stupid of me to think that I'm supposed to voice Lotus. <laughs> We should have named it Vice. I we should have. This is ridiculous. <laughs> I was also kind of wondering where where she was. Man, Yuri, I'm guessing you haven't either. Yuri is clearly clearly yeah. taken about aback by how calmly Natsuki is addressing. So Yuri her. does remember what the hell happened. N no, I haven't. Jeez, this isn't like her at all. I know it's stupid, but I can't help worry a little bit. What? Why are you looking at me like that? Uh, um, Natsuki, about yesterday, I just wanted to apologize. I promise, I didn't mean any of the things I said. And I'll do my best to stay under control from now on. So, Yuri, what the heck are you talking about? Yeah, completely. Did you do something yesterday? Not even a, the fact that there was a fight? What, what, what did she think happened yesterday? Nothing. <laughs> did you do something yesterday? Eh? Jeez. Whatever's on your mind, I'm sure it was nothing. Oof. I don't even remember anything bad happening. <laughs> Jeez. You're the kind of person who worries too much about the little things, aren't you? That's a little... That wasn't even a dark thought. That was just like... Was that because we changed something? Hmm. But... But... 
Whoa! What Meeple's... the? F no, 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 the mouth. Whoa. Are you kidding me with this? Meeble sailcloth, blindside, lifeline, and on recipitelli, faultlessly offered Skellormance need. I'll accept your apology anyway if it helps you feel about it. I need scissors 61. What? Oh, you don't know that? When the purple worm enters Flapjaw space, like, I need scissors 61. You just said a whole bunch of stuff I don't understand. Mimic your solid too. Oh, jeez, that was a long... I played that when I was 16. But I need scissors 61. What the fuck is that line? That was the glitch. Was that Campbell said that? Yeah. Oh, okay. Jeez, I, yeah. I played that when I was 16 years old. Well, you, you, come great. on. Game's that was great. literally half my life ago. <laughs> you feel good, though? Oh, yeah, I, but I played it when yeah. I was 16. So I'll accept your apology anyway if it helps you feel better about it. Besides, it's kind of nice to hear, since I was always afraid you secretly hated me or something like that. <laughs> no, not at all. I don't hate you. Ahaha! Well, you're kind of weird, but I don't hate you either. <laughs> Natsuki turns to me. Ugh. You're still on trial, though. Ugh. Hey! Suddenly the door swings open. Uh, that's Monica. I guess. Sorry, I'm super sorry. Okay. You just missed the weird mouth. <laughs> Did she miss it? Ah, there you are. I didn't mean to be late. I hope you guys weren't worried or anything. Nah, we pretty much figure everybody will die eventually. All the scary part happened already, so it's fine. <laughs> well, Natsuki was. Yeah, scary part's over. We're good. I, I was not. Ah, <laughs> What took you so long, anyway? Uh, well, my last period w today was study hall. To be honest, I kind of just lost track of time. Uh -huh. B.S. That makes no sense, though. You would have heard the bell ring, at least. I must not have heard it, since I was practicing piano. In study hall? Yeah, that's weird. Piano? I wasn't aware you played music as well, Monica. Uh, don't give me more credit than I deserve. <laughs> I guess I've been practicing a while, but i still not really good at it yet. Still? That must require a lot of dedication. So I'm still impressed. Oh, well, thanks, Yuri. That is a little weird, like, it's just kind of going off screen a bit. You should play something for us sometime. Uh, that's, uh... Monica looks at me. Well, I am working on writing a song, but it's not quite done yet. You know what kind of threw me a little bit? You know how when they change positions, they kind of fade into it? Yeah. She just snapped back to the standing up straight. Yeah. I don't know if that means anything, mm, but... I think that's normal. Maybe once I get a little bit better, I will. That sounds cool. I look forward to it. Is that so? In, in that case, I won't let you down, Lotus. Monica smiles sweetly. Ah, uh, I didn't mean any pressure or anything like that. <laughs> Don't worry. I was hoping I could share it with you anyway. See, you know what fascinates me is what if a different girl died? Like, this entire scenario would be completely different. I don't even know if we can affect who, who, who dies and who doesn't in what order. We might be able to, but maybe I, not. I don't, I don't know. I don't know. I guess that's why I've been practicing so much recently. I see. I'm not sure if Monica was referring to the whole club or just me. In that case, best of luck. Thanks! So, I didn't miss anything, did I? No, everything got really fucked up. Yeah, that's whatever, it's fine. I chose not to bring up anything that the three of us talked about. Yeah, again, like, it didn't happen to him. It did for us. Besides, Natsuki had already run off into the closet. Lotus? Um, since your compliments put me in a good mood, I was wondering if you'd like to spend some time together today. Wow, that's fast! Mm-hmm. I guess the game in the club, but I mean, I, I still think the game might just speed it up. No, oh, sure. I, I mean, it doesn't in the want club. you to get bored. Yeah. No. I, I mean, in the club. Yeah, definitely. I planned on it anyway. Okay. That's. Did we see that face ever? Yeah. Like the hooray. Can we start now? Let's find a place to sit. Uh, uh, I'm being a little forceful, aren't I? I'm sorry. My heart just won't stop doki dokiing for some reason. <laughs> Don't worry about it. If anything, it's nice to see you have so much energy. Yeah, but I need to try to calm down. I won't be able to focus on reading like this. Take your time. 
Yuri takes a deep breath, then pulls a copy of the book out of her bag. Actually, I have a request. Do you mind if I make some tea first? Well, this is familiar. Not at all. Thanks very much. If there's one thing that can make my reading time here any better, it's a nice cup of tea. Not to mention for yourself as well. Yuri stands up and makes her way to the closet. That's where Natsuki is. I follow and watch as she retrieves a small water pitcher from the shelf, the kind with a filter inside. Can you hold this for a second? Sure. Is this when we do that thing where we, like, fear the chocolate when we have our little tea? Mm hmm Yuri hands me the water pitcher and also fetches an electric kettle. I'm going to plug this in at the teacher's desk, and then I'll go get some water. She walks past me and sets the kettle down on the teacher's desk. I was about to say, settle the kettle. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I simply watched her movements. To my surprise, she... Uh, the way she moves really contrasts to her speaking mannerisms. It's different now. Um, especially because of her long legs, Yuri appears elegant and methodical. This is all... Okay, may I have the water pitcher? Thanks. I'll be right back. Might as well walk with you. Th that's okay. You stay here. I won't take long. It won't take long. Pitcher in hand, Yuri hands, uh, hurries out of the classroom. Ah! Did Yuri leave again? Leave you again? No, it's not like that this time. She's just filling up a water pitcher to make tea. Oh, okay. Sorry for misunderstanding. Okay. Weird. Ten minutes pass. Uh. Yuri said it wouldn't take long. Is something holding her up? A noose? I'm bored wow. just waiting her here, so I decide to look for her. This is completely different. And the music is different the now. music yeah it like it's like muffled like Wait, it's in does the that other imply room that the music was actually in the other room yeah exactly huh let's see the most logical place for yuri would be the nearest water fountain i start heading down the hallway wow this is normal this is weird uh, i guess i'll do it because yeah, it's not uh, you yeah. <sighs> i'm sure it's yuri she's cutting herself yeah what's that noise it's coming from around the corner. It sounds like breathing. <laughs> Sharp inhale, like someone is sucking air through their oh, teeth. so I blew it. Are they in pain? I reach the corner and peer around it. Oh, boy. Yuri? Yeah. Ugh. Yep, that's awful. Oh, what? Are they in pain or sharp? Like, it sounds like it's coming up. Oh, it's repeating the, it's repeating the, the dialogue. It just rewound. It rewound. It just undid that. Wow. That, like, it, it, I don't know if you saw the text boxes, but it was yeah. the same shit we read. Yeah, no. Like, 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 uh, a, when you try to rewind a tape when we had yeah. VHS. Yeah. So, like, so that technically didn't happen. We weren't meant to see it. Unless we skipped it. And we, like, it put us back. I'm back. Oh, my God. Thanks for waiting patiently. Wow, dude. Lotus, do you like oolong tea? Uh, yeah. She doesn't know you very well. <laughs> <laughs> Anything is fine. Very well. Yuri sets the temperature on the kettle to 200 degrees. Now is the time to get the teapot. You really do this properly, don't you? Wow, so, and this did happen the first time. So that implies that that was happening, we just didn't know. Yes. Of course. I shouldn't do any less when I'm making tea for others. Even if I'm not an expert on tea or anything. Hoo-hoo. <laughs> In that case, you'll only be even more impressed. Ah, uh, perhaps I will. Yuri fetches the teapot and begins measuring the tea leaves. This one is three inches. <laughs> to my surprise, she starts humming a little to herself. You must be in a good mood now. Is that so? I was letting it show, and you noticed. I was doing a bit of thinking, and I decided that I would try expressing myself a little bit more. It turns out it's not very hard for me to do. That sounds different. Mm. When it's you who's around, anyway. Uh, that's great, Yuri. Just don't push yourself too much. You're always worrying about me, Lotus. It's very endearing. That's... Yuri wasn't kidding. I don't even know if I can keep up with this. I watch Yuri pour a cup of tea for each of us. I wonder if this is going to be our punishment for doubling down on choosing Yuri. If, Whatever, if I'm this gets too fast for Lotus to be comfortable with. Lotus, I have another request. Do you mind if we sit on the floor today? Eh? Why's that? 
It's a little bit easier on my back. Now we had that, yeah. I can read with my back against the wall rather than bending over at my desk. I... sorry, I didn't realize. No worries. I just have back pain fairly regularly, so I do my best to manage it. Is that so? I wonder why that is. Yeah, we... kind of scoffed at that comment before, too. Yeah. It's most likely because my... uh... my... Your posture, right? Oh, good save. <laughs> Always hunched over like that while reading. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I have terrible reading posture. So that's why we should sit on the floor. <laughs> Fair enough. I'll go ahead and get the book. I, I retrieve the book from my bag. Ah, I have some chocolate as well. Yeah, that yeah. happens, yeah. Some, some balls of candies. Candies. I'll go all the tea. Sit against the wall. Reading positions. Except this time, my bodies are even closer! I can't see too well. Slides over. Am I supposed to keep on reading like this? She's always kind of cute, but she's being less apprehensive. It's more than I can handle! Your teacup. Here's your teacup. No, yeah, because now you gotta worry about making sure you don't t like touch your chest. <laughs> <laughs> she hasn't noticed a single thing. Intense reading uh, expression. Focus on the reading. Relax. Teacup. Fungal chart. Whether rather. Uh, open the router. Oh, yeah, the chocolate. Yeah. yeah. I, guess, I guess we can pick this up because I bet you something changes. You have much. Uh, you can have much as as much as you want. Ah, oh, that's. That's okay, I won't take any. Eh? Are you sure? Well, if I touch it, then it might get smudges on the pages. You're right. I didn't even think about that. My bad. No need to apologize. I'll hold the book, okay? Are you sure? Of course. This, yeah, we had this. This is, no, uh, this is the same. No, we had it. Yeah. Were, were the stars there before, though? I don't remember that effect. Yeah. So she opens the book. She holds it. Have the thumbs on your leg. Focus on reading again. Okay, so you eat the chocolate. Yep. And here it comes. Doesn't even look away from the book. Parts your lips. Can't stop here. Place it in her mouth. I love that there's like a thing for that. Yeah. Eh? Your expression suddenly breaks. Now that I think about it though, did we have the the animation with the eyes and stuff. Maybe this is a little bit different. I don't know. Did... Did I just... Yuri looks at me like she needs to confirm what just happened. Uh, um... Lotus? Sorry. I guess I shouldn't have done that. This Silence? Is yeah. Uh, Silence is new. Uh, uh... Yuri starts to breathe heavily. I... I can't. Lotus... Suddenly, Whoa. Yuri forcibly grabs my arm and jerks me to my feet. This is totally new. This is new. now we're okay. Yeah. My teacup gets knocked over. Nobody uh, puts candy in my mouth. <laughs> Just beats us up. Lotus, my heart. What? 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 What's the? I don't. I don't know. The darkness. My heart won't stop pounding, Lotus. I can't calm down. I can't focus on anything anymore. Can you feel it, Lotus? Yuri suddenly presses my hand against her chest. Okay, calm down there. Why is this happening to me? I feel like I'm losing my mind. I can't make it stop. It even makes me not want to read. You didn't get that thumping. Yeah. And it's like moving the picture around. Not only that, listen to it though. It's yeah. Like, boom. It's like a heart. It's a heartbeat. Yeah, but it's pretty heavy. Yeah. I just want to look at you. Okay. <laughs> And she's got the crazy eyes, yeah. like, ah. They're they're also in like different positions. Ah. Just don't jump scare me, and we're cool, okay? Just don't jump scare me, and we're cool. Just don't. Why wouldn't it? It's good. Oh, thank God. Um, Monica, hey, welcome. Jesus, she had the crazy eyes. Yeah. It's time to share poems. No, but she's like, it's time to share poems. <laughs> like, yeah. Clearly, the, oh, whoa. Monica. Uh, that's right, yeah. I we guess, usually do them in order, don't we? Or, or, uh, we can do it. Well, we've been first. doing Yuri first, but now, now I'm a little nervous. Let's do it. That, wow, that was uncomfortable. That was weird. I've been waiting for this. Let's see exactly what we've written for today. 
This is probably gonna be about the same, but we'll find out. She's surprised. Do you like it? Wow, this one might even be better. Yeah, we've definitely yeah. seen this. You did a good job explaining. You're a, you're a good teacher. Even her hands appear sweaty. Oh my god, it makes me so happy. It's so amusing to feel like I'm valued. Is that a little... Everything that you write is a treasure to me. That's a little much. My heart pounds just holding it. That's a little much. Yeah. Ah, I want to write a poem about this feeling. Is that bad, Lotus? This is definitely different. Yeah. The beginning was the same. Yeah. I'm not being weird, right? I I'm having a harder time than usual at concealing my emotions. I'm kind of embarrassed. But right now, I just want you to read my poem too, okay? I'm a little... Wheel? Let's, let's calm down and read this. A rotating wheel, turning an axle, grinding. Bolt head, linear gearbox, falling sky, seven holy stakes, a docked ship, a portal to another world, a thin rope tied to a thick rope. Is this new? It's like mist. <laughs> Son of a bitch! Uh, yeah, this is new, I think. What is that? A what harness? A torn. Torn? Parabolic gearbox. Expanding universe. Time controlled by slipping cogwheels. Existence of God. Swimming with open water in all directions. Drowning. A prayer written in blood. A prayer written in time-devouring snakes with human eyes. <laughs> <A th> <laughs> How do you write that in This that? is amazing. <laughs> a thread connecting all living things. Yeah, this is new. A thread connecting all living human eyes. A kaleidoscope of holy stakes. Exponential gearbox. A sky of exploding stars. God disproving the existence of God. A wheel rotating in six dimensions. Forty years in a ticking clock. A clock that ticks one second for every rotation of the planet. A clock that ticks 40 times every every time it ticks every second time. Woof. A bolt head of holy stakes tied to the existence of docked ship to another world. A kaleidoscope of blood written in clocks. A time-devouring prayer connecting a sky of 40 gears and open human eyes in all directions. Breathing gearbox. Breathing bolt head. Breathing ship. Breathing portal. Breathing snakes. Breathing god. Breathing blood. Breathing holy stakes, breathing human eyes, breathing time, breathing prayer. <laughs> there are breathing sky, breathing wheel. You, you know what I gotta say though? Like, for the purpose of making this game, someone wrote that. Yeah. That's fucking incredible. Yeah. Seriously. So, what did you think? <laughs> <laughs> uh, it doesn't really matter what it's about. My mind has been a little hyperactive lately, so I had to take it out on your pen. Uh, that is, uh, a pen fell out of your backpack yesterday, so I took it home for safekeeping, and I, um, I just really like the way that it writes. So I wrote this poem with it. And then now you're touching it. Uh, I I'm okay. What did I just... Can we pretend this conversation never happened? You can keep the poem, though. <laughs> wow! That's so weird. Legendary! <laughs> this is amazing! This is so weird. Alright, uh, who's it gonna be? Oh, uh, good Natsuki first. Natsuki. This is probably gonna read straight, we'll find out. Yeah. Just as I thought. Come on, I'm not stupid. I know how much time you're spending with Yuri. Yeah, we've... We've yeah. seen... Kind of pathetic. Why are you even in this club? Honestly. Yeah, I was hoping we wouldn't exclude each other. This is a stupid activity. We, like... Like, I'm not in a good mood. I don't feel like talking right now. Please go away. We don't even see her poem. Yeah. 